This whole thing is the title. This is a crime against humanity. What's going on guys, I'm Spoons. As those of you who have been with me for a long time know, I really try to push the boundaries on this channel. I like to do things that have never been done before, whether or not they actually need to be done. Like for example, when I auditioned for a major VTuber agency as a cowboy. Or when I screamed at a froppy figure until I lost my voice. Yeah, I'm still trying to figure that one out too. But there's a really unique project that I've been working on since well before I even conceived of those two videos that is finally done right now. See, a while back on stream, we came across this article posted a few years ago about this light novel that consisted only of a very long title. The article made some pretty crazy claims, like that director Akiyuki Shinbo was in talks to adapt the light novel as a series of anime openings. So needless to say, I was hyped out of my mind. Until I realized that this was on a satire site and it was all fake. Fuck. So what is an Anituber with an English degree and a very tenuous grasp on sanity supposed to do under these circumstances? Fine. I'll do it myself. Ladies and gentlemen, degenerates and weebs, I give you the light novel that consists only of a very long title. You think your shitty fantasy isekai light novel title is long? Look at this shit! This is an actual, start to finish, complete isekai story told in the format of a title. And it isn't like I just made a copy for myself or something. This is an actual published book. You can check it out on the Amazon link in the description. This is a real, tangible product that I wrote, and much like an oops baby that lays on the ground and eats glue, I hate it. But you can do so much with it. You can read it. You can use it as a cup holder. You can yeet it. You can do the laundry. It goes great on a sandwich. It is literally everything you have been missing in your life. You are welcome. This has every trope that you could potentially want from an isekai light novel crammed into it. It's got a high school, it's got swords, it's got sorcery, there's fantasy, there's a tsundere vice president, there's a loli, and there's an ending that promises more that'll probably never come because studios suck. This is over 200,000 characters long and over 4,000 words long. You may notice that the character count and the word count are a little off from one another. We'll get to that. And you may say to yourself, wow, Spoons, I hate you, but isn't this like a, like a world record or something? It f***ing is. Probably. See, once I finished the first draft, I decided to go check what the Guinness world record holder for longest title of a book actually was. And this is what I can only guess is some kind of science-y book about hearts, and the title is 3,777 words long. So I thought, great, my title's already longer than that, but nothing in life ever goes right, and so naturally there was a catch. The record is judged on character count, not word count. And the current record holder had almost 10,000 characters more than I did at that point. Now, how is that possible if mine had more words? You see, mine is a big, long sentence with connecting words like a or so, put together in a normal order like you would structure a sentence if you aren't terrible. But the current record holder's title was just 99%, a list of basically every animal in existence. Snooze fest, boring, more to the point, not creative. I'd already won in my mind since I had more words, so I thought, hey, if this shit stick can cheese the system, then so can I. So I took the longest chemical formula in the world, found a way to kind of halfway tie it into the end of the plot, put it in a teeny tiny font, slapped it in there, and bam, I have now beaten the world record by almost 180,000 characters. Now all that's left is to send it off to Guinness and wait 12 weeks just to receive the guidelines. So it'll, um, it'll be a minute on the official record. Even without my petty ego stroking insert here, there's still almost 90 pages of just story title. Now you may be asking, so what's the title of the book? What's it called? To which I respond, shut up, you aren't clever. It would probably take me three hours to tell you what the title of this book is. Mr. Beast did a video one time where he read just that chemical formula that I told you about a minute ago, and it took him almost two hours just for that. So. I probably won't be doing that. Unless you guys want me to, because let's face it, I don't have anything else going for me in life. I think this is possibly the greatest gift ever bestowed upon man, but don't take my word for it. Let's check out this glowing review on the Amazon store page. Because somehow people found this abomination before I officially announced it. And bought it. But that's okay, because I'm sure they're thrilled to be the first person to get to experience this. So let, let's have a look, let's see. Why so large of a name, one star? You know what? 
I love your review. I actually think it's great. In fact, I'm gonna frame it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put it in a frame so that I can stare at it for all time and just remember how great a review this was and how, oh, oh no, that, that's not a frame, that's, that's fire. I set your shitty review on fire. Oh no, what a mistake. I'm so sorry that this happened. I'm probably gonna cry about this later, boo hoo. So order your copy of this absolute train wreck today. Link's down in the description. And if Akiyuki Shinbo really wants to adapt my work into a series of anime OPs, let him know that I will consider his proposal. If you want to support my efforts to deplete my sanity as quickly as humanly possible by doing things that no one should ever do, subscribing to the channel is the best way to do that. It also helps inflate my ego, which is already the size of Texas. At least that's what it says in the About the Author section of the book. Until next time, I have been Spoons, and I'm gonna go seek penance for creating this abomination by playing in a busy intersection. Bye guys!